in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to get custom apps. Like, um, for example, over here in the applications, if I go to unknown sources, I have NordVPN on my MetaQuest 3. How did I do this? I'm gonna show you. Um, I'm gonna install Discord and probably TikTok, some other stuff. Um, but yeah, as you can see, it works. It'll connect me, you know, all kinds of stuff, right? The first thing you need to do is you need to install SideQuest. Um, so just go to sidequestvr.com, go over here, click get sidequest, um, just use the, I don't really know which one it is, hold on. Oh, you want this one. I think you want the advanced installer, yeah. So when you get here, you're going to get to this, it says um, open setup instructions. So you click over here, you're going to want to follow these instructions. Um, okay, so I just closed it and reopened it and it fixed it. But basically, so you're going to see this stuff. Uh, you want to open the setup instructions. Go follow these instructions. Uh, register yourself as a creator org or as a developer on Oculus. And then enable developer mode and reboot. And then you just plug the USB into the headset like that. And this really won't take long. It'll take like 10 minutes or something. But I'm going to go ahead and plug it in. I should already have all that set up. So let's see. When you plug it in, you'll see this start to do funny things. And you also need to go into the headset. And authorize it. See how it says right there? Go ahead and do it. So now that I've allowed it, you can see the Oculus Quest 3 right here. So <clears throat> now that you have this as green, you whatever application you want, you want to go over to Chrome and look up the APK file for it. So if I want Discord, I would go Discord APK, search it up. All right, so if you can't download it off the official site, if it takes you to Google Play, you need an actual APK file. Yeah, APK Mirror is a safe provider for APKs if you want to go that route. Um, the person who created Android Police also created APK Mirror, so it should be reputable, I guess. Um, but yeah, if you come to download it off this website, make sure you download the APK and not the bundle, because the bundle won't work, because I just tried it and it didn't work. So I'm also going to do this one. All right, so I found a Discord APK. I'm sure this is not anywhere near a most recent one, but, you know... Um, the most recent one all had bundles, and this one's just APK, so I'm going to go ahead and download this one, too. Let's try this one. All right, so after you've got your APK files, this button is what you need to click to upload them. After you click this button, you can upload it, and then it'll start. Spotify one, and look, down here it's going to say installing APK. And then when it's done, it should be on there. So I'm going to jump back to the headset, and um, we'll take a look and see if it's on there. Yeah. All right, so just a quick tip. Um, make sure it finishes because I did it earlier and it was still in process and I unplugged it before it was done. So just make sure it says this task has succeeded before you exit out. All right, so this one installed correctly. This one's the TikTok one. Sorry if you hear yelling in the background, but I wouldn't be a true gamer if there wasn't people arguing in the back. Let's get it. Uh, I'll show you guys it on the meta. All right, so back on the meta quest. After you've downloaded your files, um, I have them down here because I opened them before just to test it out. But if you go to library and then you go to not all, but if you go to applications, then you can click unknown sources. You should be able to see the apps that you installed here. So I installed this one previously, but these are the ones that I installed um, in the video. So you click on it. It opens it up. I've got my um, stuff right here, right? So works regularly, just like normal. And then also I've got TikTok, right? This is my profile, Beastish. Um, works regularly like any Android. You can also full screen it like this and pass through. Um, just to point out, you could actually probably use a regular browser to you know surf these things like you know you could open up discord or but i don't know i just really wanted the apps and for some stuff i'm not sure it would work like nordvpn so um being able to have like actual nordvpn just as an app and connect you know i thought that was really cool so anyways um thanks for watching if you enjoyed it you know let me know um peace